Hello and welcome back to the channel. We are going to take you around something a little bit different today. We are still in a Red Row property. We are at Collindale Gardens, North London, and we are in an empty show home. We are in the hallway and I just want to point out, this is actually quite a big spacious hallway. Let's turn the camera around and show you the space behind. So just zoom back a little bit. There is plenty of space to put shoes, coats. Yeah, bags. <laughs> bags, that's our bag. Um, so you can literally put a whole row of coats, a whole wall of shoes if you wanted to. There is storage. You could even probably have a little fitted cupboard above. Oh yeah. Perhaps. Um, you have your, your panel. Your uh, I think this controls certain elements of the apartment. Yeah. Um, just to focus in, we have some uh, nice lighting above, some spotlights, and we have Antico flooring beneath. Let's go through this door here. What do we have? <gasps> Ta-da! We have a bathroom. So, this is a really lovely bathroom and shower. Obviously bath with a shower above. But we have the controls over here, which I quite like because, let me just sort of show you. A demo. You can get in without getting wet. You can adjust your temperature and the flow. You can wait till it gets nice and warm and then you can step in. And it's lovely. So yes, I really like this. The tiles are nice as well. What do you think of the tiles? I think they're lovely. Hmm. Yeah, they're nice, they're warm. Yeah, and of course, red row, even being an apartment, high ceilings. Oh yes, very high ceilings. So it's lovely. Um, oh, look at this. I can see storage. Oh yes. And lots of storage. Lots of storage. Look at all those shelves. You can put all your beauty products. It's lovely. I actually really quite like this storage. And I'm thinking we could do something very similar in our home. Definitely. Um, I really do like this. The sink is by Ideal Sanitary Wear. We've got a nice flush system already built in. And a towel rail, which I love. Now, the apartments do come with underfloor heating. They do. Which is why you can't see any radiators apart from the heated towel rails. Where should we go next? Should we go to the bedroom? Yeah, let's Perfect. have a look in the bedroom. So, master bedroom, as you can see it's completely empty at the moment. Yes, which actually is really, really good. Because I know a lot of our viewers sometimes ask for an empty show home. <laughs> and this is what we've given you. Because in a way, you can visualise your own furniture in this space. So this is a bedroom. In the master bedroom, it comes with wardrobe. So there's a nice big wardrobe. It goes all the way up to the ceiling. And you've got mirror doors, rail, shelf above. And if I just show you, this is probably the area where your bed would go because you've got two um, double sockets. And if I lie down, you can actually see I'm five foot eight. So have a look, there is plenty of space around me. There is. And at the bottom of me. Plenty. So there is plenty of space for a double bed, king size bed. Could you get a super king? I'm not uh, sure. Possibly. So possibly, but you've definitely got space for a large bed. And if I just turn on the lights in here, you've got an ensuite bathroom. Ooh. In the same style as the main bathroom, you've got the beautiful storage. Um, the cupboards, I've just noticed, are by Armari. Oh. And they feel really good quality. That is the one thing that we love about Red Row, the quality. We do. Uh, you can literally feel it because even with the glide, I won't talk too much about the shower because it's the same shower yeah. pretty much as what we've seen before. Except you do, oh actually no I will, because you do have a little handheld, <laughs> which I, I like these because, oh rainfall! Was it rainfall? Yes! Oh, look at that! Rainfall shower, people, you know I'm happy. <laughs> and I like a separate uh, squirty, rinsey, because you can rinse things down yourself, the shower. It's always really handy. So, yes, I love those. Central drainage point, which again, I love. And I think the underfloor heating would be lovely in here. Oh, yeah, keep your tootsies warm. Absolutely. Carpet, they've gone for a neutral kind of grey colour, which yeah. I like. We haven't mentioned the balcony. No, there is a balcony. Yeah, so you've got a nice door. It does have a security lock. This is your outdoor space, and it's actually quite big. It is. You could definitely get a bistro set, a bench, whatever it is that you'd like to do. Use this space for. It's lovely. I like the tiling on the yeah. floor. Yeah. Um, and the doors feel really nice and secure. They're heavy. Yeah. And when you're inside, you literally, you can't hear anything. It's really, really quiet and um, 
most of the glazing is actually triple glazed, so you really can't feel anything. Ooh, okay. now, thermostat's here on the wall. It is. Um, oh, this I like. Oh, this is a deep is there, utility. Is a, um, a light switch. Ta-da. Yes. So, so we've got the uh, exchange for the underfloor heating. Yeah. You've okay. got your fuse, um, box. fuse box. All the switches and plugs and media points, internet points. Uh, you've got space for a washer dryer. Yeah. You probably could get two appliances in if you really wanted to. Also, extra storage space for your mop and bucket, Hoover, vacuum, extra shoes, extra coats. And this is the ventilation system. If you notice on the ceiling, there's one actually in the cupboard itself, and um, there's little kind of ventilation points which help with all the airflow, um, which is a really, really nice touch. So this is a very useful space. And I'm very happy to see that. Also, there's another useful wall. There is. <laughs> this wall here could be useful for storage. You could put extra coats. Yeah. You could put shelving units. It's actually a really handy wall. Um, do we have another bedroom? Can we we do. So again, another good size bedroom. You can definitely get you can definitely get a, king, a super king bed along this wall. Oh, absolutely. Also, there is space for wardrobes. I mean, a natural space for a wardrobe would be, would be there. There's also another control panel. I think that's another temperature control. Yeah. Possibly for the underfloor heating. Just for this room, maybe. Yeah. There's also, uh, again, there's ventilation points. And access onto another balcony space, which I think this one's locked. Um, but again, you've got another enclosed balcony space. So it's amazing for if it's raining. Yeah, and you need some dry some clothes, you can put a clothes horse out. Yeah, I mean you know it look, in the UK <laughs> the weather <laughs> It's not great. Let's just say the weather is interchangeable. One minute it can be sunny, the next it can be raining. This is perfect yeah. because you can have your table set out and you're not gonna get wet. It's lovely. So I would really appreciate this space. I think it's a really lovely. Also, there's a TV aerial point, so you could have a wall-mounted TV. Uh, also, I like the little slit in the window at the top. Oh yeah, that's nice. I like that. It's a nice little detail. Um, smoke alarm, I think, as well. So, let's go into, I think, what might end up being our favourite room. Yeah, definitely. Oh, wow, this is lovely. What do you think? So you've got the kitchen, so it's kind of like a kitchen and dining living. Yes. Um, obviously, this is the kitchen area. You could have maybe a table, a circular table. See, I was thinking that would be a kitchen. Kitchen over there, dining table here, roughly like a little bit stress because you've got the window. And then behind, because you've got the media points here. You could have your TV. Telly mounted on the wall with a nice sofa going across here. Yes, that would work. I mean, to be honest, anywhere that you want to do this, you can do it. Look at the amount of, uh, of light. Of lights on the ceiling, those spotlights. Those spotlights are there, is it? There's lots. <laughs> Three, it's about 15? There are many, there are many. The kitchen. Now, I really like this choice. Uh, I think this is the standard laminate because you've yes. got the glass backsplash. This looks really expensive. It does. Um, and this is the standard finish. So you've got the cupboards. Um, I'm just going to open them so you can have a look. So there's plenty of storage in there. Like I say, space in an apartment, storage space, is so important. And this, these apartments have it. They really do. Look at that. Um, obviously you've got a shallow cupboard here. You can put spices. I quite like a shallow yeah. cupboard. Um, extractor fan underneath, already built in. Uh, we've got electric um, hob by Siemens, and um, you can have a fan boost. If you want your fan boosted, it's there. We've also got pan drawers, a uh, cutlery drawer, pan drawers, and I don't think we've actually looked at these cupboards here. What are these? Ooh, ooh, dishwasher! Dishwasher! Wow, yeah, that is so handy. This is an Electrolux dishwasher. In here, you've got your under sink with your bin. I love these recycling bins; yeah. they are incredible. I've noticed as well because they haven't. I don't. I don't know whether it's something you could have on the upgraded counters, but they've got not just a sink; it's a sink and a half sink. Yeah, this is well. lovely because it almost looks integrated. 
Yeah. But it's not, it's a separate stainless steel sink and a half. But, and you, but you wouldn't know. No, it, it's lovely. Um, also, you've got an extra cupboard there and another cupboard that goes in all the way around as well. at the back. So that's very deep. You can put things that you don't use very often in the back. Another cupboard. So there's plenty of storage. Look at this. Wow. Siemens. Uh, now this, I know, is. Look at this. Microwave. It's in micro. Microwave. No, what does. Um, Microwave. What does. What's the name? Nigella. Nigella Lawson calls it a microwave. There you go. Microwave. Uh, you've also got your oven. Yeah. Which is lovely. Uh, another useful cupboard underneath for all your yeah. pots and pans. Pots, pans, baking trays. Yeah. And what do you think this could be? It's fridge. Yeah. Now this is lovely. Freezer. And there's also storage above. Storage above. This is lovely. It is absolutely, perfect. Absolutely lovely. Also, there is a little nook here. You could have this as a working from home space. You could. You could have a little desk against that. Desk. It's lovely. So, oh, also, I have a balcony. Oh yeah, and so, yeah, this is the second entrance onto the enclosed balcony. Um, which I think we can actually get from this. So look at this. The site is currently under development, so there is still building work going on. But this is a nine-acre site and a lot of it is open green space. Ooh. Space I really love. Um, yeah. like I say, you could sit down with your glass of wine, <laughs> a cup of coffee in the morning, yeah. visualize it people. Bear with me. You use this space how you want to use it. Could yeah. also be an outside play area for a child because there is railings. There so is. It is nice and safe. Um, yeah, this is lovely. I do it's like gorgeous. it. Gorgeous. Lovely. Anything else you want to say about this space? Um, I bet you're thinking as well. I have a car. Where, hmm. where, where can I put it? I do, I have a car, where can I put it? Where can I put it? Well, most of these apartment blocks, they come with their own underground, or the ground floor is exclusive for parking. It does cost extra, yeah, it's an extra. when you buy the place. Mm -hmm. It is an optional extra, but you can have your own designated parking space that's yeah. secure well, as cons well. Concierge. concierge. Oh, concierge, concierge as well. And there is also a gym on site as well. There is. Um, uh, they are building a primary school as well. Yeah, so they're building a community. Red yeah. are really stepping out they are building a community, um, and you can be part of it. These windows do actually tilt, so um, you can actually tilt them forwards, so they're actually really, really safe. There are railings as well, but you can open them and it does let in a lot of ventilation. Okay, so we are ending this video in our favourite room in the apartment, the which is, kitchen. of course, the big kitchen, dining, living, that goes out onto the balcony. Um, we really love this apartment. Oh, we do, it's gorgeous. Yeah, it's and fun. we hope that if you are thinking of buying off plan, that this empty show home tour, or empty apartment tour, because it's not a show home, no. um, is going to really help you visualise how you could put your furniture in here, and how you could live in here, which I think is very different from what we usually yeah. do. And I would like to thank Red Row, we would like to thank oh, Red Row for allowing us to do this because um, you don't normally get developers letting you see an empty show home. And I think this is going to help a lot of people, especially people from overseas looking to move into this area. Yeah. Thank you for watching this video. If you have enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to share on social media and also do hit the bell so that you know whenever we are uploading a video. Also, do have a look in the description box below for all the details and links to the development. So we have a business email. So we if do. you want us to come and visit your development, home, old or new, drop us an email, link in description. So from us, to you all and goodbye.